Hi everyone, uh, welcome to the Design and Technology Faculty. My name is Mr. Keevany. Uh, in this little video you're going to get, uh, to get a, a virtual tour of our department. You're going to get to see inside some of the workshops and uh, you're going to get to see some of the things that you'll get to design and manufacture uh, in S1. Uh, you'll also see some images from our graphic communication course uh, and that will give you a flavour of the course such as graphic design, 3D CAD modelling, uh, sketching and rendering uh, and colour theory. Hope you enjoy this tour. Hi guys, I'm Mr Warwick, uh, I teach Design and Technology at Orkin Harvey and I've got plenty of nice models here to show you. We've got nice tablet stands, we've got a speaker docking station system where you've got the opportunity to personalise it with your own logo and we make some nice plastic designs such as clocks. This is our woodworking room down in Technical and in this room we get to manufacture our first project which is the phone stand. We get to design it so we put our own text or our own designs, whatever we would like and we get to manufacture our through housing joint. We also get to use the drill to drill holes to fit our dowel in which will prop the phone up. During this project we get to learn how to safely use some hand tools so we can use the bevel edge chisel, we can use a mallet, a tenon saw, a g-cramp, a tri-square and a steel rule to manufacture our phone stands. At the end of it we get to put a nice finish on it so we can protect the wood and then it can go home. This is our metal working room down in Technical. In this room we manufacture our coat hook out of metal. During this project we get to use some various tools. We get to use some measure marking out tools such as the scriber which we use to create indents for our markings. We get to use a centre punch which allows us to line up our holes correctly for the drill. We get to use some shaping tools such as a file. We also use a rawhide mallet which allows us to bend our coat hook into the correct shape. Our final project is the plastic keyring which we will design in the classroom using different idea generation techniques such as pencil for a walk or we can design our own personalised design if we wish. When we're doing this project we will use some cutting and shaping tools to cut it and shape it into our desired. When the plastic's heated in the oven it will then be easy to bend and what I can then do is twist it into the desired shape and once it cools down it will eventually form into the shape that I'm holding at just now.
once the laser cutter is finished, you simply put it away and you can see the laser is etched on and cut the key touch here. Hi guys, this is uh, Mr Burns who's our technical technician uh, and he cuts and prepares all the timber for all of your projects. And this is his little office in here.